Hi all folks, this is Max from HighOnAndroid.com where we get so high on Android every day we just get high all day long. Um, anyway, I've got a, a review or a battle out between my Galaxy S2 which is running Resurrection ICS ROM. Um, it's using a, a stock kernel running at uh, 1.2 gigahertz um, stock stock speeds and also on the other side I've got Galaxy Nexus uh, running uh, Android Revolution HD um, running stock also 1.2 gigahertz dual core so this will be a fair test um, without any overclocking we're gonna run Quadrant here and uh, we'll see which one is uh, faster so let's do it ready go so both are running ICS so it's a fair test and also they're both 1.2 gigahertz. Um, this one is uh, running Exynos or Sinos. I, I was call it Sinos processor, the Samsung processor, which I've said a thousand times is much better than the uh, the TI OMAP on the Galaxy Nexus. Even though the TI OMAP is pretty good, I would say on the graphics side, the Samsung is much much better. And you see that, uh, oh, and the I/O file I/O is much faster. This is based on extension four. And I'm not sure, I think this is not extension 4. That's why it's, the I.O. is taking way too much there. Um, you can see the frames per second. Really take a notice at the frames per second. Um, that will kind of tell you the graphics performance, kind of. So, <clears throat> it's exciting, exciting. We'll see who wins. Um, I still feel like the Galaxy S2 is better in terms of CPU and performance and graphics. Even though the Galaxy Nexus does have higher um, higher uh, resolution, I still feel just the overall hardware, the CPU and the GPU um, is much faster on the Galaxy S2. And that's why I love this phone. The Galaxy S2 is just a really, really uh, well designed as far as hardware you know, is concerned. Um, so we go yes, yes. Um, the Galaxy S2 definitely won that test. You can see. Um, so 39.42 versus 19.97. Um, as you can see, the Galaxy S2 is much faster. You can also look at the different numbers. Uh, let's see. CPU is actually about was about the same. 56, 86, um, 57, 52. Th so the Galaxy Nexus actually won in the CPU department. Uh, memory 3745-1792. Memory is much faster on the Galaxy S2. I/O 7680 versus 1026. So the file system is much much faster also on the Galaxy S2. 2D graphics 590 versus 184. 2D graphics S2 wins. Uh, 3D 2008 versus 1233. Um, so really the bottleneck for the Galaxy Nexus is the uh, memory and the I/O file system. Um, so that's the test. Um, Galaxy S2 wins. Of course, the Galaxy Nexus is still a great phone. Uh, did I say Galaxy Nexus? No, Galaxy S2 wins. Galaxy Nexus is still a great phone. Um, it's got a much higher resolution, and also you get the uh, official ICS ice cream sandwich. Um, but my Galaxy S2 actually has a flawless ICS with the Resurrection ICS ROM. It's you know. Oh, actually, let's kind of look at how fast this, these things pop up. Um, boop. Let's do that. Home button. So the Galaxy Nexus is a little bit smoother, maybe. I'm trying to press that at the same time. Um, let's load up browser real quick. Ooh, look at that. And this is on uh, the S2 is actually on um, HSDPA, while this is on my Wi-Fi. It's much slower. Um, let's do that again, and and I've got custom ROM running, so I've got more features here. Anyway, that was a battle out for the Quadrant. Um, I can run N22 also, but uh, the results are going to be very similar. Um, so that's it. Oh, maybe I'll do another video soon with N22. Um, but the Galaxy S2 is definitely much faster. Great phone. Still a great phone. Um, you know. I don't mind, really mind the resolution that much. So anyway, uh, don't forget to hit that like button. Um, hit the um, subscribe button if you're on YouTube. And uh, also you can share it with your friends uh, if they ask you which is better phone, dude. Um, I still prefer the S2. And the you know Galaxy S2 is 
Galaxy Nexus is great, but just saying. Anyway, see y'all later. Um, don't forget to get high on Android, and I'm gonna go get more high on Android. See y'all later.